Hey folks, this is Brandon with DCC Builders and uh, we're out here uh, in sunny Florida. We're going to take a look at a little leak that we've got going on. So um, let's have a look at it. So as you can see, I just came in through the garage out there, if you can see that. And uh, so we're at the back side of the house now. And apparently they've got a leak that is coming down the wall here and dripping off of this, this door. And they've got a little uh, something to catch that down there. And so let's, uh, let's take a look up on the roof and see what we can find. All right, we're on the back side of the house here. And uh, let me show you what I got here. As you can see, the roof slopes down towards the back. There's the back door. We were just inside there uh, looking at the leak on the inside. So I'm going to guess that because the roof is sloping down and the way that water runs, water's going to just wick off of something and it's going to run down to the lowest point before it drips. So my guess is that the leak is probably not at the bottom end of the slope there, but it's probably up higher. And as you can see, there's some solar panels up there. So I'm guessing that's the culprit. Let's go up there and have a look. Got my ladder all set up on the front side of the house here. And uh, we're gonna grab some, uh, some stuff and head up on the roof and take a look at things. Okay, so we're up here on the roof and uh, there's the back door right there. So we're just in line. If we follow that up here, we can see that the solar panels are right in line with that, or at least this edge of them are. And um, so we'll come over here, we'll inspect a little bit. So you can see that they've uh, got these little legs here that attach the brackets to the solar panels. And I'm looking for something that just looks real obvious to me. And uh, let's see. There's something there. So that seems to be just in line. And I'm actually visually inspecting outside of your camera view right now. And I don't see anything else that looks as obvious. And short of pulling these solar panels off and redoing all of those legs under there, uh, we're just looking for a temporary fix for right now. And so we're going to go ahead and uh, see if we can get some some goop on that leg there. So as you can see here, I've got uh, I've got some some blackjack roof cement. I picked this up at Lowe's, and uh, we're gonna see if we can reach back there and get a little of that above uh, the opening underneath that leg. Um, my guess is, since I don't see anything else that's real obvious, that's probably where they're getting the leak. It's nothing major. It. Uh, it usually occurs when there's a real heavy downpour for a long period of time. And um, so once again, we're just doing a temporary fix here, but let's, uh, let's go after it. A little tough to get my hand back here, but uh, luckily the caulking gun has given me a little bit more reach. We're gonna go ahead and apply a bunch of this. I'm going to be liberal with it. Okay, so I was not extremely happy with um, what I was able to do from underneath the solar panel. So I went ahead and loosened some of these little brackets here. Um, and the solar panel moved out of the way fairly easily. As you can see over here, I was not able to get on the, the far side from underneath and I was just concerned that that may not get it done. So we went ahead and moved the panel out of the way. We're going to get around that real good and make sure that we get that leak sealed up and then we'll, uh, we'll talk about some other stuff. Okay, as you can see here, we've got it all buttoned up. Once again, this is just a temporary fix, not meant to be long term. Uh, but uh, we've got it all smoothed out and any water that runs down will now run over and around that and will not go underneath that leg and, and uh, penetrate uh, into the roof deck and uh, run down the attic there 
Um, I wish I could have shown you while I was doing it, but I only got the two hands. All right, so now we're gonna get this uh, button back up. We'll get that, um, that solar panel back in place. We'll get the brackets back on there and uh, everything will be good to go.